Hello everyone and welcome back to Academy. This week we're doing a special video because it's Friday the 13th week. We're doing a video together about bad luck and good luck symbols. Let's go. Number 1, the acorn. In Viking culture, an acorn is represented to protect a home from lightning. Since acorns come from oak trees which attract lightning, the Vikings saw them as sort of being spared from the wrath of Thor, so they thought that it would be protected from lightning and it would keep their homes from being struck. Number two, alligator teeth. Alligator teeth are seen in some African cultures to increase luck while gambling or pushing their luck in some sort of test. Number three, bamboo. Bamboo has often been sold as a lucky item in China, meaning friendship sometimes and that you'll have a good relationship. It can also mean that putting a bamboo plant in the east part of your room will improve your chi, according to Chinese feng shui. Number four, triangles. Throughout history, history, tri history tri triangle, tri triangles, triangles has just been seen as a symbol of power. Seen in the back of the U.S. dollar or the Egyptian pyramids, their three sides represent the three-side life cycle, birth, maturity, and death. Triangles are shown to be a powerful symbol and are also the strongest symbol in engineering. Number five, the rabbit's foot. The rabbit's foot is traditionally seen as a lucky symbol in America, and in many gift shops they sell them for people as keychains, necklaces, or other souvenir items. Number six, crickets. The insect crickets have been a good luck symbol in many cultures for years, especially Native American culture. They are seen as the protector of their homes, and when they stop their chirping, it means danger is near. Transitioning into our bad luck symbols, number seven, black cats. Black cats are seen as bad omens in Western culture because when one crosses your path, it is said to bring bad luck for you. Number eight, stepping on a grave. Stepping on a grave shows that you are dishonoring that person and being rude. Number nine, the number four. Four in China sounds like die, si, and si, which means bad luck and death. Number ten, spilling salt. Spilling salt is said to be a bad omen and you must throw it over your shoulder to reverse this omen. Number 11, pointing at rainbows. Pointing at rainbows is said to be bad luck. Looks like no more rainbow videos. Number 12, Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th was a horror move that made the day forever unlucky. Happy Friday the 13th, by the way. And don't think we forgot number 13. Number 13 is the number 13. It's always seemed an unlucky number just for the reason of Friday the 13th, a horror movie. And many people in Western culture find it the most superstitious bad omen ever. Do you buy this and superstitions in general? Comment down below if you think superstitions are really true and we should be afraid of these things, or if you're someone who just naturally feels the need to throw salt over your shoulder when you spill it. Thanks for watching this Academy video. Like, comment, and subscribe if you want more content like this. And as always, keep learning.